Saturday morning. What's up, guys? Joe with Smoking Joe's Pit Barbecue here. Sorry about the live stream situation, guys. I was having problems with it. I don't know about it, but uh, I'm going to have to practice that live screen a little bit more. But uh, I'm about to reveal, guys, um, what I've been keeping from you guys. The reason I drove uh, 18 hours uh, in one day, slept four hours, and uh, to go pick this thing up. But um, I want to show you some of my smokers, guys, uh, before I reveal um, what I wanted to reveal to you guys. But um, got my buddy Chris over here with me with uh, Bushmaster Barbecue. He's, uh, he's a buddy of mine. Uh, we've competed a couple times. We actually met competing against each other. And um, we competed once already. And we're going to be competing again in uh, Shirts, Texas uh, next week. So I'll put a video of that too. But let me show you my existing smokers. So I've got the, uh, the pit barrels you can see here. Good smoker, guys. Really happy with it. Um, nothing wrong with it. I think for for small cooks, it's good. I mean, you could fit a brisket in there, but it's uh, overall good smoker. But the uh, gateway is my new one of my new found passions, obviously, as you can see here. Um, those of you guys that don't have one of these, I highly recommend that you get one. Uh, we actually have some chickens we're practicing with here. Whew just to get different flavor profiles if you will then I got my this is just an attachment to my gas grill it's got a sink and a gas burner then I've got my gas grill over here um, got this one from Lowe's probably like five years ago guys it's still brand new I don't even cover it and I should but um, that thing works like a horse as well then I got my Yoder that I really like um, pellet smoker Guys, this thing is amazing. This is my second one that I've owned, but um, really, really happy with this smoker. Love it. Just kind of set your temperature and walk away from it. It's nice. But here's the uh, the big boy. Got myself uh, an L Ray smoker, guys. As you can see, this is a tank. It's got a really nice uh, stack with a baffle on it here. It's, I got it fully open right now because uh, actually we're going to cook some ribs on this couple of racks here in a little bit just uh figuring out the temperatures on this thing guys I, as you can see it's this side's running at 345 no sorry 320 and this side's running at 350 so big old dials i'll show you the inside here you got a lot of room in here guys you got a ton of room in here it's got a drain for the grease on the bottom left there and uh, here's the other side it's got a rack on the top you can see the fire is roaring on that side and um, couldn't find any logs guys so I just went with some lump wood that I had and um, here's a massive firebox guys look at that thing and it's not really a whole lot of wood as you can see I dumped a basket of, uh, of charcoal and uh, but that's what's burning right now. Guys, if you didn't hear that door, let me open. That thing is solid. Sounds like counting. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but guys, this thing is huge. You know, the uh, the owner of uh, El Rey Smokers was dealing with Robbie for about a month and uh, finally drove up to Fort Worth to pick this bad boy up this past weekend. Actually, what's today? Sunday. So we got back yesterday evening. Drove 18 hours, slept four hours, and drove it back home. But this thing is massive, guys. Let me sh let me show you that compared to the Yoder. Uh, that's a Yoder YS640, um, and it's a it's a baby compared to this L Ray smoker. Really happy with it, guys. It's a it's a giant smoker. I really didn't think it was going to be this big, but uh, really happy that it is. Um, you know, Chris and I were looking at it right now, and you could probably fit eight to ten briskets in there probably five or six racks on this top rack here and uh, the ribs that I'm gonna cook uh, here in a little bit I'm gonna do them hot and fast at uh, 300 degrees but all I'm doing right now guys is just trying to figure the temperature out on this thing and um, get it dialed in so this is the uh, the big secret the big reveal 
and uh, stay tuned obviously for for lots of cooks on this thing uh, if you guys have any questions on any of the smokers that I showed you guys or or this El Rey um, it is a beast um, I do plan on taking it to competitions and stuff guys but I've got a I've got a, a travel trailer um, so it's gonna be hard to to tow this and the travel trailer so I'm gonna have to probably trade my um, travel trailer in for a toy hauler a big toy hauler to fit this thing in there it's probably the size of a um, what do they call those UTVs those razors but it probably weighs twice as much I think this thing uh, weighs about 1200 pounds so it's pretty heavy um, so this is it guys um, sorry about the again sorry about the the live streaming it didn't work for some crazy reason but I'll figure that out but um, didn't want to keep you guys in suspense any longer thanks for watching guys if you guys haven't subscribed uh, please do so and thanks to all of, uh, all of my subscribers and again if you guys have any questions or comments uh, please leave them below thanks guys see ya